Okay, we're on. All right, so it's been a long time since I did an RPG Maker 2003 tutorial, but I found something that I wanted to talk about, and um, let's get into it. So this tutorial is going to be on uh, shops and in processing, or just purchasing items in RP RPG Maker 2003. So what I'm going to show you very quickly is how to add items and remove items once they've been purchased. And this is what I'm, I've been trying to do in my game. I'm going to give it a test run. So let's start from the beginning. Uh, I'm going to add the, the shop processing right here, which is on the second, on the second uh, event command. And when I click it, I have all of my items ready to be purchased. Uh, you can choose between three messages. I just want to keep it simple. Um, so I'm going to add the three items that needed to be purchased at this area specifically. So once you've gone ahead and found them on your list of items that you've made in your uh, event page, uh, what you're going to do is hit add, 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 add. And you're going to also want to click this option if player bought or sold, which is important uh, because these are supposed to be one time items. So this is what I mean by having the ability to remove rare items from the, the menu. So make sure you click this button if player bought or sold, then you're going to hit OK. And what's what's going to pop up is if there has been a transaction or no transaction. So right now the my my team only has money for the, the 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 weed killer and if there is a if there's no transaction we just leave it blank but if there is a transaction we're gonna open up this again and we're only gonna add uh, the the two since it's only technically possible for uh, the the one to get purchased I'm gonna hit OK and if they come back and they buy one of these, then it's as simple as just removing it. Or what you can do is uh, put up a uh, conditional branch here that says uh, if uh, item is in inventory. So for the next one, let's say if the if they want to buy the dynamiter and it's now in the inventory then we're going to say shop will process just the masking tape yes and add that else it's going they're going to buy the dynamiter there you go and that's one effective way around setting up a shop where you have uh, specific items so we started with three then if there's only one transaction since the maximum they could have is this and they're supposed to buy the weed killer in my game there will only be two then I set up code that says okay let's say they have lots of uh, pixie dust and they want to buy uh, the, the dynamiter first then all that's left is the masking tape and let's say they want to buy and if they don't want to buy the dynamiter or you could just say else if if you want to make your code very clear if the masking tape is in inventory then all that's left is the dynamiter and since you can't uh, find code on the internet to add to RPG Maker 2003, you, you, this is the, the, the most effective way I would think. I have it a test run, so I'll just hit OK and begin the game where I, where I left off. Let's give it a go. Alright. Alright, so we're in the shop now. Do, 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 do. Go through this dialogue very quickly. All right. 
Now you're gonna see that shop actually pop up. So he says, what do you need today? I'll buy this. Um, on the left, this is kind of cool, uh, where you see the three characters, um, it shows in bright who it can be equipped to and who it can't. So I only have one and I have six gold here and I can only buy the weed killer. So I'm just going to go ahead and equip that. Thanks. And now it's, it's bold out. So it means it can't be picked again. Um, if I press escape, um, and I press buy, I don't think I can, I can sell it, um, but it'll, it'll fade itself out. So I hit cancel and, uh, that's that. I, I hope this works and it's helpful for, uh, sh your shop processing. Um, I just want to see very quickly if I open it up again, if it's removed in the, oh, no, it's not removed. Um, but I'm, I'm fairly certain that this can't be bought again even if you have the the six gold anyways i hope that's that's helpful in uh, shop processing and um yes i'll uh, make another video as, as soon as i can all right signing off cool